This is like the most calm and radiant. Oh, I got that glow. I started off my day with some more yoga, some more stretching, and I finally got it. Like I got the, you feel me, the balance that I couldn't get yesterday. I got that joint. Tomorrow morning we go again. And it really does help. It really does help because it clears my head. If I was doing systematic processes like Excel sheets or whatever, it's, it's easy to do that and not be focused because it's a system. There's instructions, there's rules. There's no rules when it comes to Nalu. There's no rules. Day 52. I decided to give it to you something new. And I don't know what I'm talking about, but it's A. B vlogs, yeah. I just set myself up because I know when I'm watching this vlog back, I'm gonna really cringe when I see myself sing like that. But guess what? We just doing what what we wanna do. Alright? No limits. Dear Abraham, we are writing to you to let you know that we have recently updated our terms of services. Changes to YouTube's terms of services. Updating our terms of use, terms of services, privacy policy, and cookies policy. Updates to the terms of services. Wait, what's what's happening right now? What's really happening? Why is everybody is it just me? Is it just me or is everyone just updating their terms of services all of a sudden? Like what happened? Like was there a national like breach of security that i didn't know about like i don't know but that's the thing that's the thing when you're running your own company it's your job to know i didn't even have this in mind before but i have to spend this morning trying to understand why everyone's changing their terms of services and if nalu needs to then i need to also work on that with the legal team <sighs> It's, it's tough. There's a lot that happens behind the scenes because it's like terms of conditions and terms like, you know, those conditions in terms of services that nobody reads. I have to read that. I have to read that. I have to get it written legally. I have to do so much. So, so much. I'm, I'm grateful. I'm grateful for the initiative to even think about it because some people would just see it and be like, oh, nah, just a random email. But I've taken the initiative to think, okay, if everyone's changing it, something must happen. Maybe it's about Brexit. I can't seem to find anything on why the terms of, terms of services for these companies are changing. I don't know. I don't know. As far as I know, so far, Nalu is abiding by the law, so we're straight. And I'm sure there will be like a like a leeway. It's better to be safe than sorry. Another thing with Brexit, transactions have been more have been made more expensive shipping rates shipping rates shipping rates shipping has gone up 20 percent so if we were paying a thousand pounds that a thousand pounds is a thousand one thousand two hundred pounds so that 20 percent increase what happens what happens like do we just take that on the chin but as a company we gotta for me we gotta make a profit a lot of companies are changing their prices but where do we go from there just some food for thought it's not a complaint it's just i'm just trying to let you guys in on a lot of the things that happen behind the scenes that you guys are like are not made aware of have you guys ever received news that just makes you want to throw up like, i just want to throw up right now. Like, i'm just <sighs> Bruh, I'm, I just feel like throwing up right now. Like, it's actually, I remember this is the same feeling I used to feel when I got denied for so many job applications that I used to apply. I applied to John Lewis like three, four times. Like, I remember the first time they said, you will get to inform you. I felt that in my chest. Like, and that's how I feel right now. I just got some news. And of course it's about Nalu. Not not more news. I don't need no more news right now. Please, I'm not even going to read my phone. I'm not because I've had too much. I don't want to say things go wrong because I, I'm, I just don't understand. It's, it's like back to back, back to <laughs> I wish I could tell you guys the news, but no, I'm not going to speak it into existence. I'm going to just believe that this was all a dream. I, I'm going to wake up tomorrow and the news would just be a figment of my imagination. That's how I choose to see it. That's how I choose to see it. And today is gonna be cut short because my friend's having an event in a couple hours and I promised him I would attend. Cause it's a whole, like I'm on a roller coaster every day roller coaster. I need to get a diary. I need a diary. I need a diary. I need the diary to get away from thinking about work. And I just write all my feelings in there cause I really need to. <laughs> I'm laughing, 
but I want to cry. Like, I want to... <laughs> like, tears are coming out as laughter. That's how I feel right now. I'm not reading my phone. I'm not reading my phone. I refuse. No more news for today. I'm putting my phone on silent, matter of fact. Matter of fact. Matter of fact. I couldn't help it. <laughs> I couldn't help it. What does it say? Ooh, this ain't no bad news. Okay, this is, this is, this for me, this is, this is cool. Let me see. These are some of the shots from the sip and shoot that we did last year. Our first attempt at doing like a studio shoot. The photographer didn't really give it his all, but nah, David went ham at this. I love, I love how David's posing in this one. See, these are good example shots, but there's no consistency like between products. I'm just trying to go through a bunch of the examples that we have in our archive from before to see which kind of angles I want to take the new shots in to see if we're going to use these angles or if we're going to bring in total new ones. But I mean, you can see a couple, couple waves on there. You feel me? You feel me? He's a player. And don't forget, we got nachis too. Y'all gonna see. Y'all gonna see.